Parisian bus, you can't. Um, how do you say? The, um, the people, the driver, the bus driver, can don't have money, so you have to have enough money, like uh, I don't know, uh, two euro for one ticket, and if you don't, you can't take the bus. So we took the bus. He said, ah no, I don't have money, so you have to go back and the best way to have ticket is for, because the two euro ticket is just for one bus and we have to take two bus, so it means that we had to pay eight euro for both of us for two bus, so it's super super pricely is super super expensive so you have to take a um, 10 tickets um, set it's cheaper it's like uh, 40 euros for the 10 and you can buy it in the metro or like we did in the taba so we went to this taba and in this Tava there was a cute Chiba, a cute Chiba, and he was so cute. And I'm happy. And now that we search to go to Parma, the GPS said that we can have one only bus near your use to go there. So it's cool. It's very, very cool. I did. Ah, c'était le euh, jus de litchi, je sais plus trop quoi. Cette fois, super, 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 super good. Super, super, super good. And they're not in part on board of it, I hope. They said that maybe. So I hope. I hope, I hope.
were home now I hope you like this vlog and we have all of these to own box and this huge valise suitcase so I thought about making a episode bonus for all this one because I think this vlog is gonna be too long so please thumbs up here subscribe and tell me in the commentary box which magazine which shop do you like the most okay. and see you tomorrow hello sorry for the no makeup face and the yellow light is already dark outside and i really wanted to finish this video today so here i am First of all, I really wanted to thank you, all of you, who encouraged me so much and yes, it's already spring and I released my Christmas video now. Yay! Yes. I have no excuse, I'm really sorry about that time. I, I am studying and working at the same time, at the same time, so it's really difficult to me to have time for my homework and for my videos so yes but I did it finally so please please I hope you enjoy it this far and I gonna answer some questions that you maybe have so what happened to this video yes I put a effect bug effect like anything works and I'm pretty proud about it, but yes, what happens if you follow me on Instagram, you may know that my SD card is broken. I put everything on it, every video that I haven't edited yet was on this SD card and as you can see maybe here, because there is space here, that there was this little tiny cut in the middle like in the middle of the card and it wasn't respond anymore and I go home I show it to my boyfriend and he fall the SD card fall on the ground and broke into two pieces like I will, I had already cried a lot so but there is nothing to do. It's it's lost to the end. What happened the days after? The main goal of my trip in Paris wasn't like exploring, making tourism. It was for the days of the French anthropology in Paris. It's it is only one time in two years so I have the chance to go uh, it's two days about anthropology and conferences and full of presentation of discussion and it was super 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 interesting and oh my god I'm so happy to be there and I had the chance to to meet some famous anthropologists and people who was really inspiring so it it's it was so great so it was so great to be there and the first day so the first day after this vlog the vlog three it should be the vlog number four I went to this first day to the French anthropology days and because I don't have what is I don't know if I had the right to film or something like that I was busy like just meeting people and all so I wanted to make a, mi a mix of two vloggers I think I wanted to share my vlog with my brother because my brother and my boyfriend 
went to the military museum and I don't know if it should it may it should be interesting but yeah everything is lost and my 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 brother is pretty funny so I think it would be maybe a nice vlog I don't know but yeah everything is lost anyway so and the day after that I was really but really sick and I couldn't been to the day two of the French anthropology and I was really really sad about it and mad about it so I really wanted to go but I feel so fuzzy and my head was like exploding so I tried to get out to get out but I really can't I say to myself oh, Mikan, are you sure you can deal with the metro? You have like 14 minutes to go No, I don't think so I wait, I wait until the afternoon and I go I went to the afternoon but <laughs> uh, in the metro I feel Really, really, but really bad. I feel like passing out, and at this point, I was like, I need some hair. I need to to go out the metro. And I was sitting on the metro station, and this guy came. He was pretty young, and he came from the left, and was asking every people like. I'm sorry, I don't have home, I'm living outside, do you have money for me and stuff like that. And I don't really like people like this. When I see people, like, when I can and when I see people who really need money, like I give them, but like here I wasn't in the mood and I was really, really bad, I feeling really, really bad. And I was like, mm, don't come from, don't come for me. I don't want to talk to you. And he come anyway to me and ask, I'm sick. I don't have home. Can you give me some money, please? And I was pretty mean of it. to him. I was like, yeah, me too. I'm sick. And at this point, I don't know what happened but he kind of changed and like he wasn't really looking at me and he squat look my face and te and said yeah you pretty poor and at this point he met he made a assumption of towards me and said like you studying and you work until late the night and you eat not really well and I didn't want it to lie, but I wanted to be alone. So I was just like, yes, that it. And it was like, <sighs> okay, sit on the back on the on your seat to not fall behind. And if you fall, you fall like this. And and take this and this and he give me my tangerine and I was like what? <laughs> what happening? <laughs> he was like it's vitamin I help you to to open your tangerine don't do anything I'm doing it for you and like very kind and I was like so shocked and it was really hard to not cry in front of everyone because I feel so bad but like so bad I really I really was almost too faint honestly and he come to me and give me vitamins and just left he he leave 
like I don't think I don't remember if he said goodbye or something like that. He just he just left and I was <laughs> with my tangerine skin in my hand. I cannot leave put it away. I was like oh, thank you. <laughs> Yeah, this happened. And I could eat a little bit, I eat some vitamins, I could take the metro again to my main goal, the events where I went. And ah, yes, I was just so sick, it was so hard. Oh my god. And because I was sick, it like ruined everything that I planned for Paris. I wanted to go to some places, to some cake store, patisserie, bakery, and Japanese bakery too. <laughs> I wanted, like you see today in this vlog, I wanted to go to Princess Crepe, but because I was sick, I didn't go anyway. So, and the next vlog that I met was like preparing Christmas with me because I made a huge party with the Japanese student we are in Bordeaux but alone, like without her other family. So I was like, hey, let's do a big party together, a Christmas party. And I was like, by going to Ikea to go pick some stuff and like go with me at friends Ikea I-K-E Ikea I don't know Bref. but everything is lost it's not a big loss but there is this video this episode 3 bonus that I really wanted to do and like really wanted to do I I cry mostly because of that because as you can tell just a few minutes ago there is this big suitcase and a few bags the good my company bags because it wasn't only just the shopping haul that we did at that day it was the shopping haul for all the day before like Miku Live Expo and Kuzma Company Pop Up Store and I wanted to show you everything in one video and I think this video will make like 30 minutes. Yes. So I wanted really wanted to do a separate video for that. And yes, I cried a lot and just remember that I can't show it this because all the food that I bought in the Kmart it's already 18 at this point and I can't remake this video and I'm so sad for this. I'm sorry, I'm trying to look here at you but my screen of my phone is just here so... Sorry! <laughs> I, I try. Why did I tell you this all? It's because I wanted to make this haul and this haul wasn't just like a hole because I wanted to do a little giveaway for you. Yes. And yeah, because I don't have this video now, I make it a new one and my light I, is... I don't know what happened. But yes, I wanted to do a giveaway. So the price is in my hand. It's actually clear file of the Atsune Miku Symphony with a little, a little, little big sticker on the side of my hand and this clear file and this sticker is the one only available if you went to the Miku Expo Live and you, if you buy something, you can have this 
this clear file and add other ones that I don't know where it's go. I think my boyfriend took it, took it. So yes, I have a bunch of them and one with that uh, sticker so because I buy something so if you buy something you don't have the stickers and because I had I been in the Miku Expo Live I have the clear file and the stickers yes and I am I am giving away two of them I am giving in YouTube in this video one clay file with the stickers and on Instagram if you follow me if in Instagram you have a second chance to win only one clear file with the stickers okay. so I think that I am doing something like subscribe to my channel like this video and comment your favorite vlog if you prefer the vlogmas day zero or day two tell me in the commentary box for entering this giveaway and i thinking to make in instagram like follow me like this post because i'm going to post up pictures and comment under this post these pictures everything you want I don't know and because you don't have the stickers on Instagram I I hope to make a little chance more in, in plus like sharing in your story or in your feed so I thinking doing something like that yes she's cute right <laughs> And let's say like two weeks the end of the giveaway until the release of this video. So yeah, I sorry it took too long to talk. I think I gonna have that cut. But I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, comment and enter the giveaway if you want. I love you so so much and again, again, again. Thank you for your patience and your kindness toward me and my vlogmas in spring. <laughs> Bye!